Hello. Hey. Hello. Welcome to the Spazcast, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, I'm your host, Z, and I'm here with a really half the cast today. Yeah, it's only some of us today. Who's who's here? Raise your hands. It's me, Garrett, <laughs> and Fish is here. I'm Fish back. is here. Back. I'm What's back up, Fish? again. <laughs> Fish, actually back. Ra- Fish actually physically raised his hand. Just <laughs> I did raise my hand. You should be heard my sleeve go. <laughs> So yeah, we're missing uh, we're missing Bobby and Bobby. Kay and Tony. Oh, that's his name, Tony. I couldn't think of it. Yeah, he's just that strange kid that sits it's in the that, corner, yeah, all the time. Hi, Tony. Hey, Tony. he eats mac and cheese all the time. He <laughs> then leaves it all over the fucking place. <laughs> <laughs> so this week we have a pretty interesting topic. This week, I'd say um, so, and really influenced by Garrett here, and it is the your top five favorite characters. Top. Five. Five, 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 five. So Favorite difficult. Characters. It could be from anything, from video games, movies, <clears throat> games. I said that already. Yeah. TV shows. Whatever. Anything. Just Any, anything you want. The whole world of characters that have ever been created in the world. Ever. You can pick ever. from that. And that's why this sucks. And this this was one of the hardest things <laughs> to actually like conjure up before we started recording. Yeah, like everything else, sucks. we just like kind of oh, whatever. We'll just flow with it. Yeah. Was, this was actually like sitting down with pens and papers, and like we're thinking, doing homework. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> thinking about it more than just being like, well, let's go for it. Yeah. Great so, topic, but it, it's a hard one. It's really hard. Yeah. But I think I think we have our five. Right. Yeah. Because well, we were going we, yeah. back, we were saying, let's do 10. Yeah. And I was like, kidding around, like, let's do 20. But I wasn't really yeah. kidding. I mean, because there's that many characters. There's that many. At this moment, I think I'm changing my mind. Yeah. It's, <laughs> it's a good thing he has the pen then. Yeah. <laughs> he's, ready to, he's ready to change. Yeah. It's, it's a bunch of back and forth. Yeah. It's, it's, it's hard to get that top five just so solid. And, yeah. And know. because there's only the three of us, we're definitely going to be doing a part two when the rest of the cast joins us next yep. week. For, yes, for the top five. So we'll tune in then, and you'll get to hear theirs. Yeah, too. you'll get to hear all of theirs, and hopefully they're having a really hard time too. So right now, it looks like Fish is doing some serious <laughs> homework over there. So is that do you multiplication and division over there? Yeah, it's it looks like you're doing well, long division. He has a, he has such a long list. <laughs> well, you're just writing down the abbreviations yes. of, of people. And oh, we also did not reveal to each other until. We are recording this so right we're now. We're getting ready to do this right now. Actually, it's until we the, wor- the words come out of our mouth during That's the this first time we're hearing it. Yes, oh, it's not like be fun. we told each other before we hit record. Right? No, no. it's going to be right now. When live, we the live reveal. Oh, congratulations! <laughs> so, Fish, are, are you ready for your number? Like, do you have a definite definite number five, or should we go to Garrett first? You want to go over to me? I'll we're gonna go, go around. Go. The, we're go. gonna go around the horn, and we're gonna do fives. Okay. We'll, we'll start. We're gonna go five. fours, and then we're gonna end with our ones. Number one, our number one hit list. <laughs> number five for me will be. I'm biased. I'm a mechanical engineer, so I'm gonna pick Bill Nye, the science guy. <laughs> hey, that's a good <laughs> one. That Growing up as a kid, good. watching that show on PBS. Very nice. Mm-hmm. I so that so that you, you not can relate to Bill. that. Yeah, Bill, you, Bill, Bill, Bill. <laughs> So that's good, yeah. That's, that's inertia fits. is a property of matter. <laughs> that's Nerd what he alert. was doing over there. Bill he was alert, doing yeah. some solutions. I was doing physics. <laughs> he was doing his physics homework. <laughs> he graduated two years ago. He's, <laughs> he's still doing homework. Still in there. <laughs> that's that's a good call, Fish. I like that. Is that. Good. How about you, Garrett? Okay. Well, my number five. That I feel like that was the hardest for me because I went like <clears throat> someone could have sneaked into the number five. Mm-hmm. So and they did. Um, they won. They. <laughs> came down to five they were at four because i i took my five just out because it was a group of it was a group of characters you just we'll and find I, out later yeah, who I, that is. I might mention those later but um my number five is master chief okay John 117 okay. okay hang on a second i really figured that that would be a top two or three i know and most you. people i know but it's as what much happened? as i love master chief well you're when you hear my top four you're gonna know why I'm, okay i'll understand so that's why I, it, that's what was hard like Man, I love Master Chief. One of my—I it, can't wait to hear who he one of my beat favorite out. characters, or like who originally who beat him, beat him yeah. and then you change yeah. your mind again. <laughs> so, yeah, you'll find out in number four who beat him. Um, but yeah, Master Ooh, Chief, interesting. You know, he's mm. just badass to me. The armor, you know, you love it's the mystery. You of, love your chief of who is you know Master Chief, and he's yeah, he's just a. That's a good start. That's a good start to the list. Yeah, really. Yeah. Um, you got my, yours. My number five is. Just an iconic character. Okay. Mario. 
I'm, Whoa, of course oh. I'm going to pick Mario. So he's uh, he's like, he's, he's number he's five. He's at oh, five. Yeah. He's down there. Okay. And he, I mean, he okay. was going to be a top five easy with this type of category, right. but with other, like you said, with other people that right. so you think of it's me just like, that, okay, yeah. well, holy shit, you know, who is the Mario top is you? your master chief and yeah. vice versa. So, well, great. Good for yeah. you, Mario. <laughs> Congratulations for making the you list. Shoot it Yay. in there. <laughs> it's me. I'm number five. <laughs> well, that's good. Okay, I, I, good fives. All right, Fish, you got a number four. What? Number, number four. four. I picked another real person, Jackie Chan. Oh, okay. Action superstar. I've always wanted to be a stunt guy. Okay, Action really? Well, that's guy. A, Just like he did. Jack, a lot of people don't know that Jackie Chan was a oh, stuntman yeah. for Bruce Lee. Mm-hmm. Well, if you saw, I mean, ass cut. and a lot at the end of like <laughs> a lot of his movies during the credits would show all of his him doing the stunts and you that's know, my, jumping that's through like the ladders and stuff and like, yeah. breaking his nose. And you see on the, every injury he's ever yeah. sustained, and it is like some really cool Japanese that's punk band makes, playing in the background yeah. or something. <laughs> or, or him. So remember the one where it was like him singing? Yeah. Do you remember? Like, I can't remember he which movie that was. He actually has a an album musical. Right? Yeah, degree. I was gonna say he does. Yeah. Have you heard it? I haven't heard like I knew I knew that what Fish said about his degree, but I never knew. I just knew he always liked singing, like in his movies mm-hmm. and like. He's off not bad. And stuff. He's really yeah. not bad. Uh, what was that movie with the Korean people? <laughs> that doesn't narrow it down. <laughs> God, <laughs> I forget which one, but he sings in Korean too. I think. I I oh. believe so. I mean, after I we're done imagine. doing this top five list, we'll do a top five favorite Jackie Chan songs Ooh. or something. <laughs> too. His son is a singer too, J C Fong. Really, J C Fong. Oh. That sounds like a singer. He just yeah. got busted for drugs. And oh, Jackie never mind. Had to apologize. <laughs> got he didn't take the same route as Jackie. <laughs> no, <I guess. laughs> Clearly not. That's a good one. I, I've always. I mean, I grew up with Jackie Chan films. Oh, I mean, yeah, that's what yeah, that made was, my love for kung films, fu movies. Yeah. I love them. Rumble in the Bronx was my favorite back. What was the one? Oh uh, man, I I, I have my favorite. Fa- is it? Uh, or not yes, like, at Jackie Chan's first strike. First where he like goes to it. Australia yes. and stuff. Yes, that's my favorite Jackie my Chan favorite. film too. But Rumble in the Bronx is close. To oh, me. that's yeah. <laughs> just like this list, we can make a top five of Jackie Chan films, <laughs> and we could discuss them for hours probably. We'll save okay. it for another episode. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm up, aren't I? Yeah, okay. Fella. So, this is my four who took, who knocked Master Chief down to five, mm-hmm. and I brought in, and I was like, I can't not put this Man, person in there. I can't not pers- put this person, and it's not a real person, of course. <laughs> I, <don't>, yeah. I mean, <laughs> but mine is Venom. Okay. The Spider-Man villain. So, very, very okay. good. Very. Cool. I couldn't not put him in there because I mean he's my favorite villain of all times. Uh, so I was like, you know what? He's a good call. Yeah. How do you feel about Flash Thompson, Ben? I, I mean, I like. I honestly do like every incarnation of Venom, mm-hmm. but obviously there's more. I like ones more than others. Yeah. Um, like Flash Thompson, I, I like it. I, at first, I was like weary about the whole suit and the like, you know, the armor and like. Yeah. He was, st- but he was still Venom. So you know, like. Every once in a while, he would like you know freak out and the the spikes and everything. Yeah, yeah, you know, would come out and like bite people's heads off. Still, and like he wasn't <laughs> like the whole gun thing, and you know, like I was like, did that turn you off a little bit? Yeah, at first because that's I mean they've completely changed Venom. I mean yeah. it was still the symbiote, but it wasn't the Venom. He can that, control it. Yeah, and he has like, yeah, but when he freaks Instead out, of the other way around. yeah, okay. when he freaks yeah. out and got really pissed off, the actual like symbiote would just like take over and. Um, but yeah, no, I, I mean, you know, when Matt Gargan was Venom, and mm. that was kind of weird too. But like, yeah. he was still cool, and like, but <laughs> I guess it's, it's Venom. I guess it's just Venom. Anything, yeah, at that it's point, just yeah. the symbiote. I guess <laughs> I can say I like. So that's yeah. I was gonna say that. Any should host be that uh, the in symbiote. parentheses. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But uh, yeah, sweet. So, my, Steve, your number. Okay, four. this this is gonna surprise the room, I think, for my number four because I mean, I had Mario at number five, mm-hmm. but my number four is actually. The dude. Oh, the dude. The dude. Sweet. Jeffrey Lebowski from The Big Lebowski. And the reason why is because that's hands down like in my like top three favorite movies of all time. Well, that's good. I yeah. love The Big Lebowski so much. And there's what I like most about that, just that movie and everything, is that they have a festival for it mm-hmm. every year in like multiple cities. And there's actually a religion named after the dude called dudism <laughs> well, really? i did not and, know that yeah did you you didn't know this I okay did not it, know it this. might have been just something that somebody just threw in wikipedia or something like that it just made but you're up believing whatever it, I mean. but i mean i'm i'm a very strong follower it's basically <laughs> like you're 
<laughs> it's like Nicolas Cage on Reddit. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. It's more of a trend than so anything. So when you fill out it's things like, and it's like, what religion are you? You go to other and then on the line, you Dudism. Write, Dudism. And then I have to explain them <laughs> in person, like what that means. It's like, well, you're just really lazy and you don't give a shit about anything. <laughs> but I had to pick the dude just because that's like one of my favorite movies. Fuck it, man. I love it. Let's yeah. go bowling. He's Let's the reason bowling. I love White Russians. White Russians are pretty delicious too, and That's I love bowling. <laughs> yeah. So bowling is great. thanks, dude. <laughs> <laughs> okay, number three, so number we're three on number three already. already. Oh shit! This is where it started to get really complicated I too. I had to you. put him here because he had to be on my list. Ooh. The Batman. Oh, the Batman. very nice. You can't not have Batman on your list. This, this is true. He can he can do anything. Oh. <laughs> well, not. He, but you well, I guess we'll I find might. out from the rest of Garrett's list. He might. He might not. <laughs> but I'm gonna go towards. He might not. <laughs> he might not. <laughs> no, I, no. The only reason I say no, that is I, because I respect that choice. Like, though I remember the one. I think you and I had this another like little verses between two characters, and I said, "I know we Batman. Did. I know versus Spider Man. Yeah. Uh, we've had it. we've had it. We had a pretty good back and forth with that. Yeah, but it's, it's not just yeah. a me and you thing either. I mean, that's a it's, that's a common. It's overall. Yeah. Yeah. But that's a good that's a good call, Fish. I just, I'm I mean, just gonna put yeah. him in there. Why? Because Batman. Well, that is, and that, number yeah. two is Bruce Wayne. <laughs> 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 I, I'm more involved with the billionaire playboy. <laughs> yeah. But I mean, yeah, I mean, <clears throat> he's cool. people that know me, you know, recently know I'm not like the biggest fan of Batman, but I grew up on Batman. Oh yeah, you know we, I mean? all, we, we all we all definitely did. did. Yeah. 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 The movies, the action figures, like all of it. I just <laughs> over the years I've just have become more of a Marvel fan. So. Right. Yeah. It's not that I honestly like people. No, I don't yeah, hate yeah, Batman. Yeah, of course I, not. I hate Superman. I don't hate Batman. <laughs> <laughs> Me Superman, too. You can go to hell. <laughs> <laughs> but okay. Oh shit. My three. Oh my god. What okay. is it? I'm. <laughs> I still can't believe I have, like this I number three have, still like, beat no out these other two. On my <laughs> I don't. I don't know if I do either. Actually, well, you, well I'm saying yeah, the dude. I was like played. Yeah, that's that's true. I, I might as well say Jeff Bridges at that point. Too. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> everything you're in, okay, Jeff. So mine is so the top three. I also thought about. Mm-hmm. I well, I won't give it away. One of my, my number three, I have <laughs> tattooed on me, and that's Super Grover. <laughs> from Sesame Street. Oh my gosh! <laughs> so, <laughs> you mean to tell me that Super Grover beat out Venom and Master Chief? Yes, he did. Wow. But here's why. Good for because you, Grove. And this is the reason why I have him tattooed on me is because he was like my first, I want to say he's my first superhero that I ever grew up on because yeah. Sesame Street was my joint. That was it for me growing up. Like that was my first, you know, because when you're yeah. young, you don't, you know, watch Ninja Turtles and all like, cause it's all like two, you know, like when you're really ex- young. Yeah, yeah. When I mean yeah. like two, yeah. three, when, like, when you're first starting yeah. to watch TV, yeah, all the PBS yeah. shows. Basically. Yes, exactly. <laughs> so I, I had to have him in there. I really, I really felt it necessary. And whether he's three or four, I don't know. I just felt three because, like I said, I felt like it's he, a solid number. He put me at that like first superhero, if you want to call it, you know. And, yeah. and he's awesome. I mean, There's a lot of nostalgia because he's not even really a superhero, one. but he like wants to be. You know, he wants to like do just, good. And he's save, just yeah. like the rest of us. Yeah, we all want to be superheroes. Yeah, and, blue. and he's clumsy and, and he's, blue he's, and he's hairy. not the best superhero. You know, he's. <laughs> But he's, he's still go, he still hero. does it. He doesn't. He's he, still, you know, yeah. When he flies, he flies him, on yeah. the walls, and you know. Yeah, I can't imagine. But he still he doesn't give up. He still is. You yeah, know, he, I mean, there's not much you can do day. with with a man's hand up his ass. You know, yeah. <laughs> like I don't know what he expects him to do. But yeah. when you're a kid, you don't know that. <laughs> exactly. you know? It's amazing and fun. You're up so, there. Number three, Z. Bobby's gonna like this one. Um, I know. Number three. Then. Boba Fett. Boba. Boba. Got it. Got to go with Boba Fett. Boba. Because he's the main. This is this is this is another argument that we had. I think we discussed it on a previous episode. Yeah. But and we said we're gonna come back to it, but again, we won't. We're never we gonna won't. go back to that. I mean, because it'll take eight. It would take. It would take a very long time. <laughs> Look for part seven of. Yeah. For anyone who doesn't know, Boba versus Master Chief. Yeah. Was was the debate that him and I had because of a obviously piece of each one of us favor you yeah. know our favorites, but. Yeah, uh, it's. Well, Boba's. <laughs> I mean, Bo, I would say Boba's like top twenty for me. I mean, Boba kind of rules. I mean, because he was like oh, he rules. He's like kind of. I rules. mean, because like when you when you watch the Star Wars films, it's like you know he was like the one of the characters that like really stood out because each you know like Luke was you know he was just this kid and yeah. he grew up into right. you know awesome and Vader was just this 
fucking scary dude. Like when you're younger <laughs> and you see this, like, holy shit. Yeah. And you hear him breathing. You're like, oh God, I'm about right. to shit in my pants. But like Boba was like, to me, he was like him and like Han. Right. Han was like another one that I wanted to put next to Boba Fett because they were just okay. both like really badass in their own way. Is that where you were saying you wanted to put two of no, these? No, I'll, I'll, t- okay, I'll okay. tell you. Oh, that. Yeah, this, yeah. This, no, we're not. We're not now my list yet. is all screwed up. <laughs> Fish is <laughs> <and> still editing. <laughs> he's, still, he's still doing <laughs> physics homework. <laughs> <laughs> and Boba Fett's got the jetpack. And yeah, yeah. yeah. See, I mean, that was you know, his, oh my god, his suit. You know, his helmet, his, suit, like, his helmet, jetpack, his, his the, blasters, yeah. his fucking flamethrower, everything yeah. that he's got. He just has like an arsenal, and it's like, oh man, what's he gonna bust out next? It's like, but he was also kind of his own character, the too, fucking you know Swiss Army I mean? knife like, of the Star Wars universe. Yeah, <laughs> ideally. So, <laughs> yeah. But he was cool. He, I yeah. always like for some. I just really like. I mean, not for some reason. I can give you a lot of reasons, but he just was. By far my favorite, and Star Wars is iconic. Right, one of my favorite movies of all time. Exactly. You know? So, and he was like my favorite character. I think a lot of yeah. people can agree with that. Yeah, yeah. Boba, Boba for president. <laughs> oh my uh, gosh, we're at two. Number keeps, two. How the hell are we at number higher. two already? What the fuck happened? I, I pushed three other characters down <laughs> off the list. <laughs> so that's what he's been doing for, the whole time. So you revamped your whole one and two. Or what'd you do? No, one stayed. Okay. One You're stayed. Two and... two and three kind of, I put them all at the bottom. <laughs> well, we'll hit, I mean, we're, we're definitely going to do like some follow or uh, some runner ups. So <laughs> number two, Indiana Jones. Ooh. Wow. Okay. Hell yeah. He's they an archaeologist. We might as well just say Harrison Ford should be number two or <laughs> number one. <laughs> With the whip. Yeah. Okay. I I accept. <laughs> I, I was just kind of kidding, but no, Indiana Jones is an excellent, excellent call. Mm-hmm. That one scene where he just shoots the guy, the guy with the sword. Yeah, like, you're trying to look all badass. He's like, "Fuck you, <laughs> <laughs> you're dead, you're done." <laughs> that and I mean, Indiana Jones and Last Crusade was another one of like my favorite movies because him and Sean Connery together yes. in one film. Needs to happen again. <laughs> so Connor needs to come out of retirement and do another Indiana Jones. But they fucking <laughs> killed him off in the fourth film, Ruiner. God damn it. That's a good one. That is a good one, Fish. Indiana good Jones. Call. Indiana Jones. Okay. My number two is... Michelangelo from Whoa! the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh. I knew there was going to... Now, now, let me ask you something. Okay. Earlier, we were discussing, like... Group mm-hmm. as that being, wasn't my as group. Being, like that wasn't your group. No, okay. that wasn't my group. You'll hear. I really thought was. that that was going to be your group because no, I wanted to say because it, like, it's easy for me. Because I know you wanted always, to say. I know. I mean, easily. Yeah, I could. You I could didn't say even think, all the turtles I, when I said that to you. I didn't even think of the toll turtles because I Mikey's just always been it for me. Like, yeah, it's always. I never gone like me like that. It's always been Mikey. Yeah, Donnie's second, and then it's a tie, it's a toss up between Raph. And uh, it's Leo it's really a toss up between all of them because they're all so yeah, awesome I, and unique. Yeah, of course. I, mean, I would have accepted not... number two, your number two being just the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Okay, that's it. Boom. Well, it's it, it's not gonna be. R- write, Mikey, that, yeah. write that down. <laughs> <laughs> no, because Mike, you know, party dude, you know, he's the fun one. Just he, he really is making jokes yeah. and you know. So oh, always love as bad as a Mikey. new movie was. I think Mikey was the best part of it. Really, still yeah. haven't seen it. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to. That's true. I've, just, I forgot that he just saw it. Just on, uh, YouTube the elevator scene. That's all I, I saw. That. We all saw that one. Yeah, <laughs> that, that was, was a really see, cool yeah, scene. I mean, that's that's good because it, it shows their personality. Yeah, funny if they just would have like had that, I mean, I haven't seen it, but fish. If they would have had like that kind of personality throughout the entire film, would it have been better? Less Megan Fox than yes. Yeah. Okay. Then that's a lot of. What I was reading too. One it was thing, like Megan Fox was on. I did watch like a minute forty five second clip of like leading up to the elevator and kind of getting out of the elevator. And um, I didn't. I really one thing I just didn't like was Johnny Knoxville's voice as Leonardo. It just threw me. It out really of, throws you off. It's like it he was my least favorite character. It didn't movie. fit just, him at all. Like it doesn't fit. Yeah. Leo or someone big and bulky. It just. Yeah. How yeah. did all the How did all the other ones sound? How did all the other uh, sound? Did they sound? I told good? you this before. I but, thought Donnie yeah. sounded pretty good. I don't know. I don't want to be a racist, but <laughs> oh, that's right. Yeah, <laughs> Donnie kind of reminded me of like a little black kid playing with his toys. Oh, well then, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Raph was like the perfect. Oh, okay. Incarnation of Raph. Okay. Otherwise, I told Fish it's, it's not racist because he's Asian. Yeah. So he's fine. <laughs> I'm not white. I can say whatever I he want. He can say whatever. You can get away with it. It's in the Constitution. Read it. Well, the but, only uh, thing I didn't like about him was him hitting on Megan Fox so much. Oh, Mike. Mike doesn't Mikey. 
Yeah, yeah, that's it what was, I was. That's what yeah. I was reading too. Nonstop. Yeah. I pretty much there. know what the entire movie's about by like yeah. reading exactly. really shitty reviews on it <laughs> because of how terrible it apparently was. <laughs> <laughs> just like read everything. There's nothing's gonna be spoiled for me nope. at this point. I don't so, really give a shit. So. Um, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> Move on to the next one. Okay, well that's my so. number two, Michelangelo. Okay, number two. Um, your two. Okay, now this this is where earlier like Gary, you were saying that you like your three, four, or your four and five were more difficult for me it was my one and two okay so and this is also why i was saying like group early i was saying okay mm-hmm. there's this is a character but there's another character that kind of goes hand in hand with this one mm-hmm. the yin and yang mm-hmm. okay so i'm gonna say number two batman okay i know who you're going on then but joker that, it's uh, gotta be you, well, you gotta be it's gotta be no okay. i'm saying those two uh, i don't care okay. anymore i don't uh, care about this list anymore. you ruined it i don't give a shit <laughs> I'm what saying the they, because those two, well, it's like you okay, can't so, have one without the other. That's that's so that's wait, why I'm making that so argument. You, that was your one then. No, no, Batman's your two. Batman, but did you not, just reveal your one? No, I didn't reveal my number. Oh, one. Okay. No, I didn't. I reveal thought my you were saying that. No, like, I was saying like those two should be oh, okay, the number okay. two of my list no, together. But it's, like, it's one but in that case, them. yes. Because I'm gonna I'm gonna have to go with Fish, and you got to put Batman on there. Batman was like we said earlier. Grew I grew up with those films. I mean, I even. I guess it could have been just because I was younger, but even the Batman and Robin film with Arnold, oh Arnold Schwarzenegger, and chill. Mr. Freeze. <laughs> All right, the Full one cast is chill. chill. <laughs> <laughs> it was like Best the shittiest the thing movie. I've ever heard in my life. But I mean, even that was like bearable to me when I was younger. Right, like I, you, I saw that movie a lot. Right. I didn't really care. It was and then Batman. you know like, Jim Carrey like, as the Riddler is like that was pretty funny. Yeah. Tommy then, Lee Jones. Tommy Lee Jones see, is two faced. Uh, what's her name? name? Uma Thurman. I mean. Uma Thurman as Poison Ivy. What's up, girl? Is it the one with Alicia Silverstone? <laughs> yes. Yes. That's as, the one as where the they, had, back they had everybody. The they had the one. nipples on their costumes. Mm-hmm. That was, mm-hmm. I, think, I think that's what killed <laughs> a lot nipples. of people's interest. Bat nips. <laughs> it's like the bat nip. <laughs> they don't detach and you throw them. Something going to get. Yeah, something going to come out of that. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. There's little smoke pellets. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> get to the Batmobile. Pew. <laughs> yeah, that's how you call the Batmobile. You start rubbing your nipples on there. <laughs> now, Batman number two okay. for so many reasons. Okay. So, okay, hang on. How are we at number one already? <laughs> because it's just, it's, it's, it's exciting. This is, this is it's fun. Exciting. But that's okay because we'll talk about our runner Yeah, well, we said, we said we're going to, well, number ones, we're going to try to talk about why yeah. it's. Yeah. So, here we go. Here we are. Our, number one. Here we are. Number one. Now, number are we going to do our, our runner ups first? Build the suspense up. Oh. That's actually not a bad idea. Okay, we can do that. I, I mean, how, how many do you want to name? Like, do you want to do like two a, or three? Just a couple. Okay, we'll do a couple. couple. Okay, fish. Did, I you had, had, did you have I a couple? Had like two or three. I had four. Let's max out at four. Okay. Let's max I, out. I, at I'm going to try and think of four. Now it's getting I'll even fucking harder. I had three. I'm going to max out at three. Four is okay. the top. All right, I'll okay. go down okay. the list. James Bond. Okay. Because he made gadgets cool. That's true. He made gadgets cool for nerds. Who's BG? I don't even know who BG is. I'm going to cross this out. BG and doesn't know who the hell the it BGs? is. BGs? <laughs> <laughs> I love. I forgot who BG was, so they're off the list. Sorry. <laughs> they're not that important. The doctor. Remember. Okay. It's got to be on there. Uh-huh. And, oh, wait. BG. BG. None of us picked girls yet, so I'm putting Barbara Gordon down. Barbara Gordon? Barbara Gordon. Okay. Because she's badass. She got shot by the Joker. The uh, Oracle. And she ended up being the cool the, tech girl. The Oracle, yeah. Yes. Good call. And then Jason David Frank. The Super ah, Power Ranger. I feel like your list is about to go from three to four now. <laughs> it might. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Shim. Okay, so those are your runners up? Those are my runners up. Those are some good runners up. Okay. Like well, I'll, my first runner up was the one that I just took out because it was kind of the group of characters. <laughs> okay. And it's um, pretty much any Hanna-Barbera uh, cartoon character. Ooh. Okay. Because I grew okay. up on... All yeah. of them, um, you know, whether it was Captain Caveman, Hong Kong Fooey, Huckleberry Hound, the Herculoids. Mm-hmm. And not many people have heard of the Herculoids, but they're one of my favorite cartoons ever. Um, you know, Flintstones, Snorks, the Snorks were oh, awesome. Yeah. Um, but yeah, they were snorking like, awesome. Yeah, that was that that was where my like group thing came in was Han, like, just Hanna okay. Barbera. You know, the animation, just the absolutely yeah. the comedy that? that came into it. Droopy was a Hanna uh-huh. Bar- yeah. Yeah, well, wack, wacky races. I don't know if you guys remember that. There was like, yeah, it was like all the characters were racing in their own little cars every week to like, you know, win the oh, trophy. Really? Yeah, damn. 
I yeah. mean, we're going pretty far back too when you yeah, do, oh, when yeah. you talk about him. But those were like my morning cartoons. Yeah. Was anything like Hanna Barbera? Yeah. Um, my other runners up are Kirby. Okay. Like I'm, I don't even have like humans here. I just like <laughs> I think Fish is the only one that actually has like real, that's like, good, a, like, like a real I, person. But that's but that's good. Because, no, but I you know. I do have one. Okay. I do have one. And this was I th- this one <laughs> I couldn't go top five with him, but Chris Farley's like my favorite. Yes, act, actor, oh, but not, yeah. I'm going to say his. Since we're talking characters, yeah. I'm going to say uh, Hi Ru from Beverly Hills Ninja. Yeah, the Great White Ninja. Yeah, he is my favorite like movie character of all time. <laughs> so I'm definitely going to go with Hi Ru of the Takador Dojo <laughs> of the Takador. <laughs> Spire. Um, that was an awesome film. So yeah, his second to last one, I think. Um, his last one was Almost Heroes. Yeah, that which, was his last one. In my opinion, that was one of his funniest films. Oh, yeah, that was I great. loved, 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 loved that movie. Um, okay, well, those are my runners-up. Okay. Now, now those I, are my barely ends. Yeah. Uh, I would have to say runners-up for me, um, I really, I wouldn't, I'll, yeah, I want to throw the Turtles in there as a runner-up because, okay. yet again, another character or group of characters that we mm-hmm. all grew up with, another icon. Yeah. Um, if we're talking about real people, I want pizza now. <laughs> we're gonna go get some. We're definitely gonna get some fucking pizza after this. After this conversation, Ninja Turtles. Mm, I'm craving pizza. Um, okay, bye guys. <laughs> no, see um, you next week. <laughs> yeah. Um, more runners up. Okay, I'm gonna say we that. We almost got in there. It was like barely like. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, yeah. I th- I threw the turtles in there. Um, I wanted to put. Um, Ace Ventura on that list. You know, he was well. up there for me. I mean, I really, really wanted to, ten. but it's like, because that's like the first, like, as far as comedy movies go, because that's like my thing mm-hmm. or comedies from, especially from the 80s and 90s, mid, mid, early to mid 90s. And that's like one that I remember like seeing in theaters. Like, I, I, like my dad was like, all right, let's go to theater. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> let's go see this movie. I'm like, awesome. Right. Like, I don't know. I, I don't know what I'm about to see. It just looked funny from the trailer. Um, but in, even Damn. even those movies, know. even that character today, like when you grow up and you get older, it's like, oh yeah, you go back and watch those, and then of course there's the adult, a lot of adult, uh, adult <laughs> yes, humor in those yes, movies. It's not just like, some tall oh goofy guy God. running around. Yeah. That was hair. a movie where I learned that boys had peepees and girls didn't. <laughs> 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 I thought that was kindergarten cop. I was like, boys have a penis, girls have a vagina. <laughs> well, yeah, in the first, I, uh, I guess, close <laughs> one of the first in the first like what ten minutes, he returns the dog. To the girl, and he's yeah. hanging on the ceiling, he's like, and he's Zip. yeah, <laughs> like, is he dancing. I had no idea what yeah. that was, and he then was like, like, oh, she's like shaking him around. Like, yeah, like, <laughs> it's a hug swing or something. I don't know what the hell's going on. Then you grow up, you're like, oh, oh that makes so much more sense now. <laughs> it's then that, that, and even that's like one of the hottest scenes in cinematic history. <laughs> no, the hottest scene was him giving birth. I don't know. Mommy, look! He's <laughs> like, it's like warming these rhinos. <laughs> I have to watch it now. Yeah, we're gonna watch that new pizza. <laughs> There's your evening. God, even the, even like thinking of like runners up is kind of difficult too. You have one more. Um, let's see, one more. Not really. We can always come back to no it. Dragon Ball Z's. Yes, actually, yes, because yeah. Steve. Okay, thank you. <laughs> even no, I'm sitting here I was like, looking at. Yeah, I, I even yeah. I said that. I fucking said. That. I see. I knew I was gonna forget some and come back. To it. it was a K moment. She's not here. Um, <laughs> no, because I was like looking at the this really sweet print that I have of Vegeta, and like I was like, oh man. I, I mean, I could probably think of like three or four Dragon Ball Z characters. Who is is it? Goku. Who is I, w- it I would you? have to say probably. Probably Vegeta. Oh, okay. And that could be, and that's the print that I have because he's, he's awesome, man. He's just awesome. Vegeta. He's like short and he's badass. He's like badass, but he always gets his ass kicked a lot, like most of the time. Like, but he just like, but it's cool because he has a lot. Like, it's like veracity. And he like doesn't give up, and he's and he's somehow really he cool. ended up with Bulma, and he still ended up with like the hottest anime <laughs> chick ever. Like, good for you, man. I was always a Piccolo. Piccolo's yes, me. Cool. That's Piccolo. Yeah. I was like, it was just close the character. He's just the cool that look. voice. Yeah, the voice. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he, he was another one that was like just as badass. Uh, how many characters blow up the moon? Yeah, it's, this is true. <laughs> <laughs> this is very true. Mm-hmm. But I wanted to throw Trunks in there too, like as well as like Vegeta. Mm-hmm. I mean, he was just always a, a yeah good favorite too. But if I think of another runner-up, or if you guys think of another one, you just want to throw in there anyway. Um. What well, I well, I said what Kirby the Hanna Barbera. I mean, I didn't. I would agree with like uh, Fish about the Green Ranger. I mean, 
Yeah, he was. Yeah, you know, he's. I definitely mean, you could in say there. you might as well say Power Rangers. Yeah, I mean, also that's, that's and I could say Indiana right. Jones too. I mean, right? There's just so 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 many. I think that's why. Like when we do our part two, we're gonna have a lot more to say. Yeah. <laughs> now until we're just, it's not just gonna be the other yeah. guys. We're not even gonna let them say that. Yeah, those. like no, nah, you're gonna wait your turn like everybody else. <laughs> we, we waited, we waited for you. Now you wait. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so okay, is it time? Well, I think it's it's the here. final reveal. Number bum, one. Bum, number one. Bum, okay, num- number one, fish. I mean it's no it's no mystery. I'm gonna pick Spider Man. Yeah. Spidey He's like the ideal idol. He always tries to do what's right. He's an engineer like me. <laughs> he always gets the hot girls. Another relatable Boom. character. Yeah. And he's Spider Man. <laughs> yeah, I mean that's a good that's an excellent number one. I'm sure that's number one on a ton of people's lists and that's why i'm going to turn right over to garrett <laughs> yeah. i was trying to think of something to say i was like i don't know who else is yeah. top that would be but uh it's definitely mine yeah so i'm there with you mm-hmm. uh, best superhero best thing of all time that mm-hmm. has ever existed in the comic world movie world cartoon or anything in history in history, in history of yeah. things that are characters spider-man is the greatest of all time yeah and you but had... I agree with anything f- with Fish said, because <laughs> he is right. But yeah. what makes, I think what appeals to me with Spider-Man, I think you can agree with this, is like, he's like, he's very relatable because he's, yes. uh, absolutely. Uh, he has girl problems. I feel um, bad for him, son. You know, he has. I had to throw yeah. that in. I, I had to throw <laughs> that in. Sorry. Okay, okay, sorry. But, you know, and then, like, of course, every superhero has their, you know, family members that die. But, you know, like, mm-hmm. it really hit hit Peter Parker that he, you know, like, has his code and his mantra that came from that. Mm-hmm. Um, but, you know, like, yeah, I, I know he doesn't kill people and neither does Batman. But, mm-hmm. you know, Spidey just, um, I don't know. I you just feel like you can relate to him because, I mean, you you know, they show him go through high school and college and he has real jobs and mm-hmm. you know sometimes he's broke and you know he has you know enemies like as peter parker and as spider-man i don't and yeah. I, don't know, I just he i don't know he's the best he's just the best he has the best villains too i yes. that's what i was getting ready for you to say is like is and i that think even be- like dc fans can agree with that. yeah i mean like I, do, I totally agree with that i mean i'm i'm one like that that fine line of like fans of both marvel and dc like yeah. that's why i like i've really loved spider-man i i might i might love batman just that much more right you well, know yeah, and it's for a lot they, of the same reason well not you know the whole high school and all that stuff but <laughs> like you know because he's like you know he's awesome like, especially the villains like i'm i'm actually a lot more of like a villain fan mm-hmm. than i am yeah hero fan a lot of the times um I actually just i this is off subject but not really. It's okay. Because I just thought of another runner-up. Is okay. the Incredible Hulk. Okay. I want to throw the Incredible Hulk in there, too. Because well, yeah, he's awesome. I didn't even... Because when I first thought of this, I was like, hmm, should we do superheroes? And I was like, oh, I'll just do we could t- everyone. Yeah. I was going to do the top five. And I was like, oh, they're all on my leg. They're all on I your leg. On yeah. My leg. Yeah. But then I was like, no, nah, that's too easy. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Spider-Man. I, I, because I was going to say Wolverine, the Hulk, the thing, like <laughs> Iron Man, the like, Hulk's thing. I could, just go, <laughs> I could just go on and on with all yeah. of them. But. You, really, you really could. I mean, that's... But yeah, that's, that's why this list was so hard to put together. I really. was figuring you're going to say that fish because I know you we know shared it. that bond together. Yeah. And I knew one of you. T- I, it's, it's I had so, a feeling it was going to be number one for both of you. So I was like, and I think that's no fantastic. Surprise. Yeah, good job, guys. Spectacular, amazing, <laughs> ultimate, <laughs> superior. <Yeah. laughs> well, no, let's not, okay, it's not that superior. let's not go there. Okay. It wasn't Peter. Okay, okay, I, I crossed the line. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Your turn. All right. right. My my number one is <gasps> the doctor. Oh, uh, gotta okay. go with the doctor because just one. I was gonna say that. Just about uh, to say it. There is no just one because the doctor is the doctor. Okay. The doctor's the okay. same, but there's actors that play him. So no, okay. I mean well, that's what I mean. Like yeah, it's, you know, everybody I mean, that's, has that's their hard to narrow down. I mean, I would probably say like the tenth doctor, David Tennant, would Woo! be my favorite. And I, I know Fish agrees with me. Well, that one, Matt Smith was incredible, and I'm really looking forward to to Peter Capaldi mm-hmm. and everything he's doing because that episode was awesome in the first episode. Um, but I think the reason I picked that is because like I never watched a show and like went through every single emotion you could possibly go through as a human being yeah. before, and it's a sci-fi like like dramedy kind right. of thing, and I've never experience that with like I mean you know everybody watches movies and TV shows they get really into it and stuff mm-hmm. and it's like. Mm-hmm. Not bad, <laughs> yeah. But this is like one where I'm like, holy shit! Like, yeah, I, I just binge so watched. Involved in it, and it's yeah. like it, it's the first show that I like really like binge watched. Like, I, I sat 
in the basement and just watched it for six hours straight. Right. Like just a, like an entire two series. Got like, just I mean, like yeah, that. Caught you, yeah. It was like that. I mean, it's a show that has been on for 50 plus years now on and off really. And that's I mean, saying something that gap, too, you like, know, it's, it's, yeah. it's a character that's any yeah. character that sticks around. I mean, like and that, that's the thing. Like not a lot of people, I mean, yeah, not a lot of people would say like the doctor, like they even know who the hell that is, you know? Well, I'm not even a doctor. <clears throat> not that I choose not to be, but I've just, I've never gotten into it, never yeah. watched it, but I know what it is. I know how big it is. How big it it's is, like yeah. huge, like yeah. really they big. They do like, world, I mean, they just, I think they just <clears throat> finished their world tour like a couple weeks yeah. ago, the Doctor Who world tour. And this first it, episode and like, was the biggest U.S. Uh, debut ever. Really? Like, most viewers in the U.S. Really? For a Doctor Who episode. For, for a Doctor Who episode, yeah. Wow. I mean, and it's only going to continue to do that. Mm-hmm. And, that's and a, it's got, I think it's gotten bigger because of Comic-Cons and because of like, yeah, of you everything. know, all this stuff that's gotten bigger yeah. with it, you know, that yeah. it just has yeah. come out. You know, because you said it's been around for 50 years. Yeah. And back then there wasn't Comic-Con or anything to promote it more than exactly. just being on TV. It's amazing so. that it lasted as long as it did back then. I mean, right. like like I said earlier, like it, it had like a little, like a brief stint of, a, I don't know how many years where it was off air. Like in the 80s t- up to... Up the like, movie was, was it like right? Was it that long? I thought I thought it ended like early like nineties or something like that, and then late eighties, two thousand five when 90s. it came back on. So it had mm-hmm. like a pretty good. I guess it had a pretty good. Um, well, the movie long. was in the nineties because that had Will Sasso in it. That's how I know. <laughs> Will Sasso. <laughs> <laughs> Go to Will Sasso. I like how you threw the Will Sasso in there. Will you know, Sasso. Hashtag Will Sasso. Runner up, Will Sasso. <laughs> yeah, there you go. There's another. <laughs> Mad TV. <laughs> I no, I mean, and, and the other thing with that show is that like they cannot like they not only been on for fifty years, but they could be on easily for another fifty more, just because of like the amount of character mm-hmm. and just everything about that show is incredible to me. Right. I look forward every single time it's on. If it, whenever there's a rerun, I always watch it, even though it's one I've seen yeah. many times before. It just happens. I think everybody has a show or a movie or anything like that, a comic, a right. video game, whatever. Mm-hmm. Like it's just it's it's an an amazing go-to, yeah, for me, and I, well, I had awesome. to have yeah, that be my number one because yeah. it's well, like that's your number one. I never that's really why, been yeah. that that excited about anything, <laughs> cried that much. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, forget, remi- you, know? you forget it's a family show too, with it all is. this drama and all this seriousness, mm-hmm. and it's just fun. It's fun, fun. I that's think, what that's what makes me want to get into it too, is because. I just it's getting bigger and bigger and bigger. And bigger but and not like, even it's, it's just I know yeah. everybody like you guys say it's awesome, so it's like. If we have the same taste, then yeah, and I it's, would think it I would like it. So. Yeah, it wouldn't be that hard. To, I mean, because the thing is, like, we watched, like, did you, Fish, did you watch any of the, like, old, like, I mean, like, old episodes? Some like, of they the had serials. a lot on, Net, on Netflix, yeah. and, like, and I watched them, too, and it's like, even that was, like, exciting, because, like, yeah. but you got to think of it, like, of a back then, like, of its time. Right. That's pretty, this is some sweet stuff we're watching. Mm-hmm. But I really just watched it from 2005 with the Ninth Doctor and on, and that's, for anybody that doesn't watch it, like you, for example, Garrett, like start there right, yeah, and just watch it. You know, yeah. it's, it's, it, do, it doesn't take that long to, to get into, I, mm-hmm. I think anyway. But Simon great. Pegg, season one, he's a guest star. Oh, cool. Yeah. Simon Pegg. <laughs> wow. You reminded me because you were Simon Pegg. <laughs> runner up, Simon <laughs> Pegg. I'm going to say more, more, one more wide runner up <laughs> yeah. is Heisenberg from Breaking Bad. Breaking Bad, yeah. I just think, I mean, but you made me like think of that because of, you know, TV and just like mm-hmm. characters and, yeah. um, but also, I mean, Brian Cranston won, you know, for best actor for yeah. the drama series for Emmys, but, um, they killed it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I just, it's just one of those characters that, that, I mean, not that he was the only one that made that show great, but it's just like when Walter White turned into Heisenberg and you were just like, holy shit, this <laughs> character is just nuts. <laughs> and cause you never thought he would, he hit it well, you know, he just like, I don't know. It's, it's just, amazing that like he played that kind of character after coming from Malcolm in the Middle, <laughs> right? Like the dad from Malcolm yeah. in the Middle. So, like, good for you, man. Yeah, but, I, think, um, I think we came up with an excellent, our, an excellent, yeah. excellent list. I mean, I love that you know I shared my number one with someone just because. Yeah. It shows you. I really want, and honestly, I knew that was like, going to happen. Though. <laughs> no, yeah, I, I, we all did. <laughs> we all did. But let, I mean, let's be fair. Like, I really wanted to put so many characters in this top five. Like, I really wanted oh, to yeah. put Spider Man in there too. And like, uh, there's so many. Well, cause, and also would, because we're going characters from anything. From anything at all, yeah. Like if, we said, were, if we did if we do superheroes down, or yeah. just like, you know, movies, it yeah. would have been easier. Even if, if we, we gave ourselves that, a challenge. Yeah, it, would, it would be difficult. Yeah. <laughs> even, that, even that for me, <laughs> yeah, was so, I couldn't really yeah. think of a top five favorite movie. I got a question. Right now. If you if you guys were to pick a female, because not that's true. neither of you picked a female. female. That's, that's, that's true. Okay. I'm um, going. Do you have one? Black Cat. Black Cat. Okay. Spider-Man. I mean, that's she's sexy 
she's, <laughs> she's up on my wall upstairs. Yeah, I mean, she's on my, in my apartment. <laughs> um, I'll probably <laughs> not the act. Like it's not like a real black cat on his wall. Like just nailed to, to the wall or anything. Yeah, that's a good one. Uh, I'm gonna say okay. I'm I'm going on the other side here with DC. I'm gonna have to say Harley Quinn. Okay. okay. Okay, she's reputable. She's I, funny. I, I, she's she's, oh, yeah, black, yeah, she's a very interesting character. You never know what she came to do. my mind. So that's first yeah, thing. that was the first thing that came to mind too, as yeah. far as female goes. Um, that or Julia Roberts, but I decided to go with the less crazy one. I was going to say <laughs> anything that uh, anything that Jessica Negri dresses. Oh, up as. there it is. Good thing Kay's not here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Anything she dresses as is my favorite. Is your favorite top five character. <laughs> Pikachu. <laughs> you might as well have just said yeah. that at the beginning. Jessica need to be dressed as this, as, as this, this, as this. And then my number one overall is everything else. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, Gary. No, yeah. everything else is a runner-up. Yes. Right. Every, yeah. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's true, too. All right. Well, we had our five. And uh, like Steve Z here said... Uh, <laughs> Just stay tuned for two. Yeah, part, part two. Part two's coming next week, and uh, definitely tell us what your top fives are. Yeah, we want to know. It's hard, but we... It's very difficult. I mean, you could put down a top five, top ten, top whatever. Just give us give us ideas. Yeah, um, we want to hear you. I want seven. Okay, good seven. <laughs> well, we okay. did like we did do like 15. Yeah, <laughs> just so okay, to be up. fair to our listeners, okay, you guys can do seven, <laughs> no more. Let's not get selfish. <laughs> so, yeah, but... So thanks for listening. Yeah, thanks for. We're uh, gonna go get some pizza and watch. We're gonna go get some the yeah, East Ventura. East Ventura. All righty then. <laughs> <laughs> and on that note, <laughs> so yeah, and again, uh, be sure to look for us at Baltimore Comic Con September six. Coming up, we'll be giving out some pretty sweet, pretty yeah. sweet items. We got some, some cool merch, really neat merch, and we're giving it away for free. So Since for I'm free. not a regular yeah. cast member. Am I eligible to win? Maybe. I mean, <laughs> you live in the same house as half the cast, so you're going to get well, a lot of shit for free. Anyway. Yeah, that's like, debatable. You know. I'm in New Jersey more than that. That's true. That's true. <laughs> this we'll is do, your second appearance on the podcast. That we'll, we'll, we'll discuss. Maybe when you reach number five, we'll, we'll, we'll talk more. I'll be in costume. You won't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We're like, here you go. And we're like, hey. wait a minute. <laughs> I know that guy. <laughs> I know that Asian Oh, guy. man. <laughs> But, but yeah, yeah. We'll see, maybe we'll all see you then and approach us. Say hi. Yeah, come, please come say hi. Even though you don't know what we, well, you kind of know what we look like from our Facebook. From the Facebook, if you yeah. follow. The but Facebook. either way, I will be the one wearing. I'll actually be wearing a T-shirt that has Spazcast on the front of it. I'm actually going to have a Spazcast T-shirt. And if you come say hi, you might get one too, maybe. Or just and take Steve's. Or you just take mine. <laughs> I mean, I'll I'll gladly just put my musk all over it. <laughs> And just give it to you. You should wear it over your Deadpool costume. I should. There you go. Okay, well then look for Deadpool in the Spazcast shirt. And look for and, a guy with other people. <laughs> tattoos on his legs with superheroes and stuff. Super yeah. Grover. Look yeah, for Super Grover. Super Grover. He's going to be dressed as Super Grover. <laughs> I do have the Super Grover uh, costume. Do okay, you? Then wear yeah. that. Holy crap. So I probably will. I'm okay, then look Super for Grover. Deadpool look and for Super, Super Grover. Grover. And then, boom. That's it. We love you. <laughs> Thanks for listening, guys. Thank you. See ya. See ya.